Um, the swim was, it wasn't a quick swim. I got, it was a bit rough and tumble. I think I've got a slight black eye from it. Um, but, so I missed that front pack, which was disappointing, but it's, you know, a long day. So, um, coming out with Daniela's never a bad thing. And I think I was feeling a bit stronger on the way out. Um, so we had a good pace and, you know, we caught that front pack before we headed off up to Harvey. Um, and it, I was very happy when we got some wind out there. It was kind of my kind of conditions and it kind of really broke up the field, which kind of helped helped me. <laughs> um, Danielle was super strong coming back from Harvey and uh, like gapped us all. Um, and I started to claw a bit more time back. And I was like, coming into T2, I just hoped I would feel good running, but I, it took a little while for my run legs to come round and uh, yeah, Daniela pulled away. And then you, the big question is always, <laughs> where's Reddy? And uh, yeah, she caught me just um, kind of a mile out of the energy lab and was running so strong. She's, you know, she's a superb athlete. Um, but it was close. It's, it's getting closer, and I think the top, uh, the top three were all in within a, two minutes or a minute and a half. So um, massive congrats to, to Rini again and to Daniela to do that on your first time in Kona. It's impressive. <laughs> How did you decide whether to kind of stay your own, do your own race, or try to go with Daniela when she was going out in front? You know, I, I'm not a slave to my power meter, but I definitely know if I spend too long, like out of my comfort zone, it's it's not going to be it's going to impact on my run. So I have confidence that I'm strong in the back 20 miles. So I figured I could, my, I had a better chance of kind of getting some time back. Um, yeah, as we got back to town. What a piece of advice definitely stuck out to you from from your coach Dave Scott. Um, he he was great out on on the run course. Just little prompts to kind of make sure I keep my running form because I was definitely struggling and feeling a little tense. And you know, just little trigger things that we go through in training um, really helped me once we got on the Queen K. And um, I kind of found a, a much better rhythm. Yeah.